Hi guys, so today we're going to talk about how to make money online in Kenya by selling Canva templates on Etsy. So I want you to go to Etsy and what I want you to search is Canva templates. Once you search that, the first result here is of this person selling Instagram post templates and so far they have been reviewed by 3,200 people. So we are going to assume these are the people that have bought from them. So 3296, then we multiply that by 15. So that gives us $49,000. So we're going to assume they made this amount in one year. So we divide that by 12 and we get that they were making around $4,000 every month. If we divide this by 30, we're going to get that they were making around $137 daily. If we multiply this by 116 Kenya shillings, that is to change that to Kenya shillings, that means these people are making around 15,000 Kenya shillings daily by selling Canva templates. So what kind of templates am I talking about? If you scroll here, you'll find that this one was selling Instagram post templates. This one is selling ebook templates. This one, business card templates, email marketing templates, wedding, itinerary templates, Etsy shop templates, Airbnb host templates. So there is lots of templates you can sell on Etsy. And uh, that is what I'll show you in this video. I'll show you how to create this kind of templates. And then I'll show you how to list them or how to sell them on Etsy. Before we talk about that, allow me to welcome everybody that is new to this channel. Remember to subscribe if you're not and turn on that notification so that you don't miss make money online videos in 2022 that I post in the future. So definitely step number one, you're going to start by doing research. What I mean by doing research is we've already established there are so many types of templates you can sell. So you want to do research by knowing which type of template sell more. So these results are sought based on relevancy. And according to this, Instagram, ebook and business templates are what seem to be doing best. If we sort again, based maybe on lowest price, we still get Instagram, Instagram email marketing. If we search based on highest price, we're going to get business card the same. If we get, if we search by top customer reviews, the same Instagram, Instagram. And then if we search maybe based the most recent Instagram Instagram the next thing now what you're going to do is create the template and we're talking of Canva template so we're going to use Canva in this example because what I know how to create is Pinterest pins I'm going to show you with the example of a Pinterest pin template so go to Canva on the search bar what we're going to search here is Pinterest we search Pinterest and basically what we are looking for is the ideal size. So we are going to go with this size of 1000 by 1500. Simply click on it, wait for, for it to load. So when you are selling Canva templates, they advise against using their pre-made template. So you cannot use these pre-made templates if you're planning to sell the template. You must create your own template from scratch. So we're going to create or uh, click or choose this. That is create a blank uh, template. So once you have this, I'm assuming that at least you have some uh, idea of what you want to create and we can put something together here so we can start by adding an image element and then maybe we're going to search for uh, typing 
let's just search for someone typing. So when it comes to photos, if you use the pro, if you use the pro photos, that is the, the paid options. If you zoom this, you will see that there is this pro options and the free options. So if you use the pro options, if the person buying the template doesn't have a pro account, they will not see that image. So when creating the template, it's advisable you use free images. So in this case, we're going to create this template with a free image like that one. So we're going just to, to position the image there. Then we're going just to design this. So I'm going to click on elements and then I'm just going to take this shape here, this shape, uh, simply make it white. So simply just make these white like that. Like that. So I'm just going to reduce the transparency, reduce the transparency, and then we're going to add text now. And here we're going to create this text. And then I'm just going to use maybe this pre-made one. And then we're going maybe to say, we can keep it happy birthday. We can choose to say that it is a birthday template that we're creating. And then maybe add another element for birthday, birthday photos or graphics. Let's use graphics here. And maybe add that cake there like that. That we can change all pray uh, around with these colors as you please. Maybe this can be white or uh, pink, like that. So you play around. Remember, you are selling this template, you have to spend time working on it. So, in this video, I'm just showing you a nutshell of some of the steps you need to complete. So, I'm not really making this to be really outstanding. I'm just showing you uh, a nutshell of what is required of you. So maybe to finalize this, I can add a border like that one, like that one, this way, and then like that. So I want to assume that my design is done. That is, you have completed your design. You are happy with it. It looks unique. It looks beautiful. It looks like something that people would buy from you. So after you complete the design now, you want to go to the third step, which is get your template link. So this is very easy when you have Canva Pro. So in my case, I have Canva Pro. So I will show you the method I use for Canva Pro. I don't know how to get the template link for a free account, but you simply can go watch a YouTube so if you have a Canva Pro account, which is very affordable, I think $6 a month, and you can get my affiliate link in the description if you decide to buy. So what you just do is you click here on, uh, click here on this button, share. After you click that, you want to choose this option, template link. So we just want to uh, click on that and then copy the template. So I'm just going to paste it on a new window for you to simply see how it will look like. So this is it. A template created by Hilda has been shared with you. So that is uh, your first template. So you're going to repeat this process with several other templates. So what you're going to do is this is template number one. This is template number one. So you're going to create at least 10 templates. That is another pin, another pin, and another pin. Okay. So after you are done now, what you're going to do is you're going to copy all these links. Copy all these links. Copy the link for the first template. And then save them all in a Word document. Or when if you use Google Docs, just save it there. For me, I'm just going to save them in a Word document. So save those links in a Word document like that. And then again, what you're going to do is download this image. So we're just going to say share and then download the image. So 
to proceed to the next step, you will need to have 10 images and you'll need to have these links saved in some place. So after you are done with your templates, the next thing you want to do now is we want to make a deliverable. What is a deliverable is, remember you have 10 links. You cannot go sharing all these 10 links. So we want to put these links in one place such that it will become more beautiful and easy for your buyer to assess them. So what we're going to do is go back still to Canva. And when we are in Canva, what we are going to search is a template for, we're going to search a template for, we're going to search a template for A4, A4 document, A4, this one, A4 document, wait for it to load. So remember, like I said, you are selling these things. You cannot use this pre-made template. So we're simply going to work with a blank template. And then, and then what we're just going to do here is we want to compile all this list of the things or the templates in one place. So maybe we are going to start by saying a text. We're going to add a text here. And we're going to start by telling them this. Let's use this. Then we're going to start by telling them, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For, for buying from us. Something like that. That will be the title. And then after the title, you're definitely going to give instructions on how to use the template. Instructions like, um, you're going maybe to tell them like, um, like uh, how to download, how to download instructions like how to download. Uh, instructions like use of images in the template, in the template. We're going maybe to tell them instructions on how to buy from, how to get, how to get other products from you, other products from you, like that. Simple things like those. So you arrange them there. Uh, it will be something that you arrange there, uh, like that. And then the next thing now what you're going to do is definitely you're going to add a page here and then now you're going to give your templates. So remember the template images you downloaded, we're going to upload them here, download, upload them here. And then after we upload, so you're going to put it there, put it there, put it there like that. So this is the template you're selling. This is a template you're selling. So what you need to do is add a download a download link. So what we're just going to do is click on elements and then search button. We're going to search a button. So we want to add a button whereby people can download. So we are just going to add this type of button here, this one here. And then we're going maybe to make the color consistent to the colors in that image. Then we're going to add a text, a text which says download, which says download here, download here, like that, like that, then put it there, then maybe change the color to red. So what I'm just simply going to do is I'm going to group this. So you just click on them, hold shift, and then just uh, choose group like that. And what we are going to do is add the link. Remember the link you saved? There's a link I told you to save. So you're going to copy this link that way, and then you're going to add it. You're going to add it on this design. Click on it, then this, then you're going to add link, and then Paste it there, then uh, you just enter. 
at the end of the day, if you add all the pages in this, what you should end up with, with is something like this. So I have the cover page, the cover page, and then I have that page I was telling you, thank you for buying from us. I explained to them how to use the template, how to get them, I give my email, my website, my contact, my image. And then now I am giving these images now, all of them, like that, like that, like that, like that. So after you complete now, let's say now you have already done working on your guide like this one. What you do is you come and click here, share. Once you click on share, what you're going to do is download. And what you want to download it as is PDF. And then we click on download. If we open this like this, if we open this like this one, and then they click on that, they'll be taken to your template like that and then they can customize it as they wish so the next step now is going to list we're going now to list that pdf like these people by listing i mean this is the pdf you see this person is selling a digital file one pdf so that pdf which we downloaded is what we shall attach as the file that we are selling so when listing when listing you will need number one a title and to get the title just go back here and say canva keen template and what you're going to do is look at these people what kind of titles are they using and you simply use the same you see like this person interest templates for canva so you use the same title or edit the same title for more exposure what you'll also need is the pricing determine the kind of price you're going to charge for instance these people three dollar fifteen dollar like that just look at the average of what these people are selling the other thing you will need is a description a description of your post the same way simply open the profiles of these people see the description they have written edit and then you will also need um, i think that's the basic you will need these images this is called etsy listing images there is this one there is that one that one etsy listing images and simply go back to canva search etsy search etsy and you'll get templates templates for etsy shop banner the banner you'll get for Etsy shop icon, you'll get templates for these, the selling or listing images, this kind of images that the people have used, these ones. So you can all get this from templates on Canva. So you will need these listing images, the icon, the banner, and putting up your listing like this. So basically to open an ST shop, that's a long process. Listing the Etsy product is a long process and I cannot do it in this video. It will make this video too long. So what I'll recommend you to do before I do the video of listing is go just to Google and say how to start selling on Etsy. For me, this is the video I watched, this one, and it was really helpful. And you will get a step-by-step -step guide on how to list your product on Etsy, how to price your products, and everything you need to know about listing your product on Etsy. So that is it about selling templates on Etsy. I hope that that was useful to you. So guys, we've come to the end. And uh, before I leave, I want to remind you to do several things. I want to remind you to subscribe if you've not kindly and also turn on that notification so that you get notified every time i put up a new video which i try to do every every two days or just daily so you see this video which you are watching so i'm assuming this is the video so you're going to scroll down and then you're going to come here you're going to eat this like if you found the content in this video you will want to like it that is very important for youtube to help rank my videos and make it do better again you're going to share it that is if you found it useful and important to help someone else 
and then you're going here in the description click here on show more and in the description you'll find the links in the description and the most important thing that you'll find in the description is my free blogging guide guys remember for me the main way that i make money online in kenya is by blogging so if you want to really understand how i do blogging how i've been a successful blogger how you can get started get this free blogging guide by clicking on this link and this link will take you to this whereby you can get your free copy of this book by entering your name and your email address and you should get your free blogging copy again on the description you'll find other related videos that i've done in the past which can teach you more ways to make money online in kenya and then finally you want to come here to the comment section and add your comment be free free to ask questions free to give any type of feedback free even to just say thank you that's really important for youtube to help rank my videos and help them do better so guys that's it until next time bye bye from me right now and i hope that this has been helpful bye bye for now